This is a short video for the Open University on Program Express, the cloud-based portfolio program and project tracking solution. Uh, we are a light PPM solution that's easy to implement, easy to configure and easy to train in. My name's Nick Wilson, Managing Director of Program Express. You'll see here that in the video we've already applied uh, corporate branding, colour palettes, um, to make it look like your own. It's cloud-based and I'm just showing a demo system, but it would be um, ou.programexpress.co.uk or Open University or whatever you wanted to call it, .programexpress.co.uk. So this is probably about seven to ten minute video and I'm going to log on as the administrator. You can be a right access administrator or a read-only user. I'm going to demonstrate to start off with as an administrator and it will take us into the front page or the home page of Program Express where you can configure your portfolios, programs and projects. So just a demonstration structure. Um, you'll see here under the portfolio we've got some programs of activity and underneath that we have projects. From this screen you've got easy visibility of all the projects and the red, amber, green status broken down by the modules shown here as icons, uh, but replicated here through the updates tab as commentary, planning, resource management, cost management, benefit realization, impact management, risk registers and logs, which are issues, actions, uh, decisions or whatever you want to configure. So you can do most things from this screen, assuming everybody's uh, populated their data. You can interrogate um, data by specific module. Um, you can filter. If you don't want to have a look at the greens and the ambers, you just want to see where the reds are and move straight to the hot spots where the problem areas are of the project. Or I can put them all back in place, the red, amber, green status. Um, everybody's made their updates. Uh, we can see as the administrator all the projects and all the modules, and we can start to run reports. So a couple of program and portfolio reports as an example. So automatically, we've set up some shared reports which were configured from the reporting screen. And let's run our bread and butter report, the RAG status summary. So a bit like a summarised Excel of everybody's Word document that they've sent in. Don't need to do that anymore. Um, here you'll see, um, like I say, the XX style uh, report with the projects within their programmes. Um, information on the project manager, some planning, some red, amber, green, and the narrative commentary. Now, these are configurable um, columns. You can change this report and you can change the settings of it. So this is just an example, but you can very quickly see all the projects and the summary um, health on what we call our RAG status report. Another example, because we've got planning information, we could go and run our Gantt chart report again at the portfolio level, but we can run this report at program level, at project level, or we can set up our own portfolio if we so wish. You'll, you'll see here all the projects and the phases, and we use the taskbars of red, amber, green, green being on track, red being it's missed a key milestone data, and amber being it's forecasting to be later than expected. So a couple of examples of how quickly you can get sort of like project um, MIS or program uh, reporting and information. Now the system's only as good as the data that goes in it. From a UI perspective it's very simple to update and the experience for the user will be depending on what access you've given them. So there's plenty of different user access, what people can see, what they can write uh, to and what can they can uh, read. So I'm going to log on as myself Nick Wilson. And I've been given restricted access as a project manager. Same URL, same home screen, but now a filtered view of read access or I can toggle to write access. And this tells me what projects I have to update, I'm responsible for, and what modules I need to populate. So um, you will have recognized there were lots of modules, but you can actually filter by different departments and what they um, actually have to update. So if I can click on a project, I go into the commentary, I make my updates on the commentary and the commentary threads and you can configure those. I go into my plan. I can have a look at the plan. I can make updates and I go into my logs. That's all that's been requested of me. I've got issues, actions, decisions, red, amber, green, change about, add a few, 
uh, complete a few. Um, and when I've made those changes, 15 to 20 minutes, I might have set up my own reports only visible to me so I can have a look at what the report will look like and that's what will be distributed. Um, so I can just have a look and see, make sure I'm happy with it. So plan on a page, drops nicely into PowerPoint, key milestones shown as a timeline, some commentary information. Again, you can configure and change those. Or I may want to run a more prints to highlight type report. So this is a portrait report with more detail. And close that down a bit. You'll see some commentary information, some plans, some risks, and some log information, more detail, something that maybe a project manager will use with their project team to update status on risks and actions. But very simple UI from the uh, project manager's perspective. You can give them read access, and we encourage to do that to the whole portfolio. Um, you don't have to, but uh, what that means is we can see what else is going on and we can run all the reports. Um, just so that we've got visibility, and that's one of the key things about Program Express, visibility of the portfolio. Uh, but you can also hide private and confidential projects. So very quickly back into the administrator screen, just to wrap up. Let's assume everybody's made their updates again. And one of the reports that the administrator can run, well, anybody can run as long as they've got access, at the portfolio level, um, is, for example, a one page summary PPT. And I've filtered this by active projects. So it will pick up all the active projects in the system. And then you'll see now I've got 10 pages of projects, warehouse management system, moving forward to fulfillment, file security, server security, et cetera, et cetera. So at my fingertips, I can now produce a pack of information. What I can also do is I can set up my own portfolio and I can wire and change around the projects, move them about. I can drag and drop, set up my own portfolio and maybe run against the top 10 priority one projects, set up that portfolio. Or I may be interested in resource planning. So let's have a look at the resource usage summary at the top level. This is not a deep dive resource management solution, but it replaces the need for Excel and resources are aligned to the plans that are set up within Program Express. So as the plan changes, the resourcing will change. So you'll see the resource, what projects they're working on, days in a period and whether they're over and under allocated and a bit more on day rate, total days assigned to the projects, etc. Very simple view of the resources, the health of them, whether they're over allocated. And there are many more resource reports. Uh, availability by resource, availability by skill, usage by skill, usage by project. But I won't go into that in too much detail now. That would be more of a fuller demo. So I'm going to stop there and say thank you very much for watching. Hopefully the next steps would be a fuller demo, be it on site or um, a webinar to some key stakeholders. Um, but for now, thank you very much for watching and hope uh, to be in touch.